Hey, Brian from Garage Mall. Today I had the Wen Polisher. Um, we are actually going to be waxing and com actually compounding and waxing the hood of our one uh, car. So I figured I'd pick one of these up, make job the job a little bit easier. So let's open it, see what we get inside. And one of the reasons why I got this is it comes with a case, which I think is always very neat and cool for uh, pretty much anything that you get. I like doing a lot of storage and being able to put things in a variety of different places. And if it comes with a case, it just makes <clears throat> that process so much easier. So right away we can see, let me get this box out of the way. All right, so right away we can see it's got a nice, one of these blow mold cases and we open it up. And so here is the random orbital polisher. And it's obviously got a bunch of things with it, so we'll move that case out of the way. Comes wrapped in a nice plastic bag. And then, so you can kind of see how, as it rotates, it's gonna have kind of a that oscillating shape to it and it has a nice foam pad to it so it should conform to any texture that it's going to be on. So you get a couple different bonnets. I almost lost one. So you have one, two, you got three different bonnets. So these are two are for the orbital. It looks like that one is probably like for your hand. <laughs> All right, so let's look up for the other couple bonnets it comes with. So again, it comes with like the two Terry, and then it has more of a smoother type bonnet that comes with that. And then you have your uh, instructional booklet. So that's your 10 inch waxer and polisher. So it just comes with your instruction manual. So it goes through a couple different things. So it basically will tell you that your polyester applicator bonnet, synthetic wool polishing bonnet, and cotton polishing bonnet. And then it does have the synthetic wool washing mitt. So that makes it an all in one kit. And then, uh, so basically polyester applicator bonnet used for application bonnet to apply wax quickly and evenly. Um, then you have a cotton polishing bonnet used to help spread wax evenly across the surface. So your synthetic wool. Uh, more aggressive fabric should be primarily for paint corrections for best results follow up with a less aggressive pad and polishing compound. So it just kind of give you an idea. And then it'll give you your exploded parts view on that. But uh, other than that, that's pretty cool. We're gonna go plug it in, get it to work. I'll get some uh, some footage with that, and uh, we'll be right back. So here I'm using the uh, kind of like the synthetic wool to polish the hood out. We had some uh, some dents and stuff that we had to get uh, removed, so we had to take strip the wax off completely. So we we're just polishing it down to get some of the scratches out, but I'll give you an idea of how. Uh, how that's working so it's working pretty good like I said it's more of a two-hand operation here but for filming purposes but uh yeah great so far now just to give you an idea so that side it's the side that I use the polish and then this is the side that we've been buffing out so what a what a nice job nice symmetrical wax application on that but again, you can tell the, the difference. And then we'll uh, show you the complete after. And that is the, uh, the finished product. And like I said, we had some pretty bad dents in the hood. And they are almost invisible after the, the dent correction, as well as a, uh, a nice buff out with the, uh, the Wen Random Orbital Waxer. This thing did a great job. Anyhow, uh, all right, and we just ran over the entire hood with a one of the clean bonnets. 
and we got all the excess wax off that so you can see how that really has a nice nice shine to it and like I said kind of helped overall camouflage that little dent which is kind of hard to see it's almost invisible now but yeah what a nice job okay quick tips and tricks that I learned using the uh, DeWen 10 inch random orbital waxer uh, thing worked out great so there's a couple bonnets that's in there one it's this one it kind of almost reminds me like of a shower cap and this one I put down as the base on the pad and basically what this is going to do is it's going to act as a barrier and make sure that none of the wax or the compounds get drawn into the actual pad itself so these are kind of like a uh, kind of like a barrier for your pad to keep it in the, the best working order for you uh, the next bonnet that you have is uh, you get two of these and they're kind of like the almost like kind of synthetic wool and what I was doing for best results was I used one bonnet that I used to put the polishing compound on the machine and basically on the paint itself and then I used a the cleaner bonnet to actually remove any of the excess polish that was left on. So that's what those were used for. And then these two, um, they're more kind of like a, a terry cloth type material. Um, one I used to apply the wax, and then the other bonnet I used to kind of basically like remove any of the excess wax and get a nice deep shine out of uh, out of the car. Uh, and you can tell from the pictures, they did a, a fantastic job. And like I said, I had done some dent removal on the hood, and we just had some scratches and some uh, some other issues going on with it. And this orbital waxer was able to basically get a mirror-like finish on there, and it helps camouflage a lot of the imperfections in the paint that I had left over from the uh, from the dent removal. Uh, the two compounds that I used. I used a turtle wax polishing compound as kind of like uh, the, what I used for on uh, the synthetic wool bonnets. And then I used the uh, a turtle wax wax uh, for the finished product. And again, you can tell from the pictures, these two products, as well as the Wen Orbital Wax, did a fantastic job. Um, absolutely uh, can't say anything more than just what a great job it did. Anyway, uh, Brian from Garage Mahal. Thanks for watching and just checking everything out. And uh, this will make your compounding and waxing a breeze on your vehicles. Be safe out there.